Hi guys, Uncle Jesse here. I'm Zia Heidi here. So, we got a comment, and uh, we just want to let y'all know that we're fine. Uh, Welcome to Uncle, Uncle Jesse's Philippines Adventure. Like, share, subscribe, and click the bell, please. Thank you. Uh, I love you. I love you. We need money. <laughs> Anyway, we've been busy. Sorry about the shaking. That's where I normally sit. It's a mess, I know. We're under construction. We got this wall started to smooth, like this wall over here, as you can see. And it takes time. As you go up the stairs, Ooh, baby, I see you're hiding. You go up the stairs, you see the sliding glass door. Of course, this is our bedroom. Y'all have seen that. We got all the walls smoothed all the way to the top. Okay. And you come into the living room from the bedroom. Sliding glass door is going to be here. See you sitting on the scaffolding. Of course, out here on the balcony, I'm going to have a bar across the top of the balcony. Put some bar stools out there. We need to trim up them trees. Okay, here's where we left off. We got this room almost complete. That's the hard part up here. That is going to be our hidey bed. Upstairs, so to speak. And this is going to be the laundry room slash walk-in closet. I'm going to put a sliding door that slides behind this wall here. Up there, the ceiling's going to be higher in that room for the extra bed upstairs. And as you can see, we got plenty of room here that I don't have to duck underneath the second bed. We're going to close this stairwell off with the, the false ceiling. Or it'll be a bed on top of the false ceiling. And then in here, the ceilings will run around that beam and the same in the bedroom. They'll be up here. And of course, unlike most houses in the Philippines, we're going to heavily insulate our false ceilings because we're going to have the upstairs air conned. And uh, that's the problem you run into in the Philippines. Y'all check out the view on the balcony. Is uh, yeah. they don't insulate their false ceilings. So in the heat of the day, if you go upstairs in a two-story and you uh, turn on the air con and close off the windows, the heat in the upstairs overpowers the air con because... There's no insulation and everything goes right out the top. So that's what we've been doing, guys. Uh, we just, we've just been minding our own business, taking care of ourselves. And I've been uh, letting Zia Honey do her TikTok and play her games. And I've been relaxing, really. Pops has been working hard on the house, as you can see out the back window. You see the mango tree. And the farms out there, I know you can't see it for the glare of the light. And you come in our walk-in closet slash laundry room. And you see out the back. And then, I'm not going to be climbing up there until we get a set of stairs. We're going to put a set of stairs right here. Or a ladder that probably... Zia's niece's nephews can climb up if they want to come camp out with her. But that's what we've been up to, guys. Just smooshing walls. Got the floor leveled in here. As you can see, it's ready for tile, the floor is. Uh, we need to do some more spackling to smooth the walls. Get the windows in. 
The electrician, I don't know if I mentioned this, I probably have, but the electrician is supposed to come next month. We got all the electrical supplies except for a couple of breakers, which they're really cheap. And, uh, but yeah, we ain't been hiding from nobody. I mean, we, we live in Tarlock. Everybody knows it. So, uh, well, baby, they know we live in Tarlock. So, I mean, you know, Tarlock's as big as Georgia. So if they want to come hunt us down, let them come hunt us down. But anyway, that's what we've been doing. This is the first application on this wall, so it's pretty rough. But, uh... Ooh, I wonder who that gorgeous couple is. But, uh, that's what we've been doing, guys. And, uh... Just been being lazy, enjoying my retirement. And... That's about it. Minding our own business. I mean, you know, really don't care what other people's doing. Really don't care what other people's up to. We got enough on our own plate to worry about ourselves and keep ourselves busy. But anyway, guys, I don't know if you can see me, but uh, no, you can't. My hand's in the way. But uh, our gimbal's messed up. It's acting stupid and needs charging. But that's what we've been up to, guys. So, if everybody's had a couple comments, people worried what we've been doing, if we was okay, we're great. So we figured we'd fill y'all in. And, you know, let me turn this back around. Where you going, boo? Come here. I'm going to close it out. If I can figure out how to hold it. But anyway, guys, uh, that's what we've been up to. And the light's shining. Okay, you want to hold it? But that's what we've been doing, guys. And uh, our Chi-Chi Poo-Poo come in to get in her bed. But uh, we've just been hanging out, minding our own business, doing our own thing. Uh... So if YouTube decides they don't want our videos up anymore, huh, who cares? I'm from the generation that didn't have all that. I got better things to do than worry about what other people are doing. So y'all take care of one another out there. And uh, for God's sake, quit telling lies. You don't know. You don't know what we're doing. You don't even know who we are because you won't meet us. I mean, uh, I've sent out my email address, and uh, it seems like it keeps getting deleted. I'll put it up in this post. You want to contact me personally and meet? We can do it. Good day. Good day.